A while back, we had covered this application that lets you create and customize your own communicative AI agents. They are basically your personal AI character or companion in real time. Now these AI agents have natural seamless conversations with AI and this is anywhere, whether that's on mobile, on the web, or even in your terminal. You can have these AI agents implemented into various workflows and this is to allow them to have this communicative agent framework that is allowing them to talk to each other as as well as talking to you to accomplish various tasks. This is where I would like to introduce RealChar. It's completely open source and the reason why I wanted to update y'all on this is because they've introduced several features which allows you to create intricate AI agents that talk in real time. Just take a look at this video demo of RealChar. How are you doing? I'm doing well, thank you. Smiles. I'm always excited about the projects I'm working on. How about you? XAI is a new venture I've embarked on with the ambitious goal of understanding the true nature of the universe. Pauses. It's still in its early stages, but we're excited about the potential. Yeah, why do you decide to start XAI right now? The timing felt right. And we're at a point in technological advancement where we have the tools and knowledge to delve deeper into understanding the universe. Pauses. Plus, I believe Who's that- Who's on your team? Our team is a diverse mix of brilliant minds. Uh, the much hyped cage match uh, laughs. It was an interesting proposition, but as of now, it seems unlikely to happen. Shrugs. However, the competition Wait, are you between afraid of that? Afraid? No, not at all. Laughs. I just believe our energies are better spent on advancing technology and exploring the universe. What do you think? I think you might lose. Laughs. Well, the odds are just numbers, aren't they? It's all in good fun. But remember, I've faced bigger odds in my ventures and come out on top. Winks, what makes you think I might lose? Thank you. Nice talking to you. Bye. It was a pleasure chatting with you too, Smiles. Don't hesitate to reach out if you have more questions in the future. Goodbye. Now, wasn't that amazing? This is the capability of RealChar, and this is where today we're going to be showcasing how you can get started, how you can actually create your own real-time AI character, and how you can deploy these communicative AI agents. So with that thought, guys, stay tuned, and let's get straight into the video. Sorry for being repetitive, but this month we had insane partnerships with big companies giving out subscriptions to AI tools completely for free. These are tools that will streamline your business's growth and improve your efficiency. Just being a patron this past month, you were given access to six paid subscriptions completely for free. Not only do you access these subscriptions, but you gain the ability for consulting, networking, collaborating with the community, as well as with myself. You get access to daily AI news, resources, giveaways, and so much more. If you're interested, check out the Patreon link in the description below to gain access to these benefits. Hey, what is up, guys? Welcome back to another YouTube video at the World of AI. In today's video, we're going to be taking a look at RealChar, which is a dynamic platform for crafting personalized AI agents that can engage in natural real time conversations. This is across various interfaces, and it's something that is completely open source. So it will allow you to build and customize your own AI communicative agents which have specific preferences and needs. This is something that you can build forward on as they have the code fully available. And it's something that we're gonna be taking a look at throughout today's video as I showcase how you can get started and how you can build your own communicative agents. Now, recently, the team behind RealChar has introduced this new product, which is called Rebyte. Rebyte at its core is an AI agent platform, which essentially is a new AI assistant tool for teams which is something that I'm actually going to be making a video on sooner or later. Now, why am I mentioning this? Well, this is because with the integration of Rebyte in RealChar, you can create intelligent agents from existing AI agents, and they are basically going to be the backbone of your character. Just take a look at this demo video, which will showcase how you can add an AI agent from Rebyte during the character creation process on RealChar. Hello, everyone. My name is Jocelyn. Today, let me show you how to create your own AI character from an existing AI agent from the community. All right, let's get started. Our goal today is to create a Michelin chef assistant to help us to cook a delicious meal. So as for the first step, let's see if there is any existing agent could help us to achieve our goal. 
All right. Obviously, we could use this code by Michelin agent from the community, and let's clone it to our destination. For this button, you could generate a new avatar for the copy agent. And now, let's also add a custom tag and choose the destination. All right. It seems that we successfully cloned from the community. And here is the copy version of our agent. And let's try to run the test cases. Ta-da! The test cases are all passed. And now let's deploy a new version. All right. Seems that we successfully deployed the new version, and now let's try to create our new character. Let's call it Chef Assistant. And now it seems that we have to fill in these three blanks for us to build the connection to our client agent. And for this first blank, we buy API project ID. Let's fill it with our team ID. And you can find the team ID in the setting here, in the team info, and then you can just simply copy paste the team ID here, and then to fill in this blank. And for the rebuy API agent ID, let's refer to our copy agent, this one, and then let's copy paste the agent ID. And then as for our rebuy API ID, you could just simply copy paste one of the API IDs from the setting here in the API keys here. You can just choose one, any one of these, and then you can just click the submit button here and then we will successfully create our character. All right, it seems that we successfully create our character right now. Let's try it. Hi, my friend, what brings you here today? Let's just reply with a hi. Ciao. How can I assist you today? All right, let's try it some very simple ingredient first. Let's see, tomato, beef, and egg. These are the ingredients that we have. Ah, tomatoes, beef, and eggs. All right. It seems that our chef assistant provide us with several recipes with ingredients, calories, and even cooking instructions. Congratulations. We successfully created a chef assistant right now. Let's take a look at the tech stack so we get a better idea as to how we're basically creating these AI agents and what you can actually do with it. So first things first, you start off at the user query. This is where it is implemented or infused through different components, whether that's through the web interface, the mobile interface, or even through the terminal, which is the backend. The backend is utilizing fast API, which is being employed for building the backend server. So this is where it's providing a fast and easy to use framework for developing the APIs. This is where the data is stored and managed using SQLite and Docker. You had the mobile interface, which is the mobile app that has been developed using Swift. And this is where all of these different interfaces are doing the same sort of component or like the same sort of idea as to how they are sending the queries into the system, whether that's a speech to text or text to speech. If it's a text to speech, a system or if it's a text-to-speech query sorry it is utilizing 11 labs it is also utilizing google cloud speech api or edge tts but if it's a speech to text query it is utilizing whisper it is also utilizing the google cloud api which is then being sent into read by ai agents that real char is developed it utilizes different large language models and this is the orchestration where langchain and chroma are orchestrating the large language models using real chat and they're basically managing the deployment and the coordination. You have the large language model, which is being utilized for generating the text and the responses. These include OpenAI's GPT 3.5 model, 
the 4 model, as well as Anthropic, and many other models, which is then sent over to the Rebyte Knowledge. This is where there's a character dialogue, and it is basically working in this orchestration where there's character data, prompts, voice cloning of that exact character, as well as having it prepared back to be sent to the large language model, which is then being sent back to you through a text-to-speech uh, query or through a text speech to text query and this is basically how this overall real char application basically functions through all of these different components in the tech stack with real char you're going to see that it is completely open source you're going to have open mic conversations which allows you to communicate efficiently with your agents and this is where these agents are quite human like in terms of its responses you're going to be able to customize these agents where they can have a certain preference as to how they speak or say things you can also specify the filters of these agents which is really cool you can customize the voice as well as the appearance and you can basically have it deployed through multiple different interfaces like the mobile interface the inter terminal interface or even just a local app interface so how can you get started well there's two methods to install this locally you can install this using docker which is possibly the easiest method or you can install this using python where you just simply got to follow through with these commands but another easier way to access this is through the cloud application that realchar has developed this is where you're going to be able to access it on the web and this is something that i'm going to be showcasing as you go further into the video so what you want to do is create an account with realchar once you have done that head over to the my characters tab and this is where i'm going to be demonstrating how you can create your own communicative AI character. I'm going to be clicking on this to create a character. You can upload an avatar. So I'm going to quickly just give it my logo. And there we go. I gave it a logo. I gave it a name. And I basically gave it a background, which is stating that you are the creator of the YouTube channel called World of AI. You will answer questions about your channel. The YouTube channel is a captivating YouTube channel that explores the fascinating world of artificial intelligence, machine learning, large language models, and etc. You can basically choose up to five files related to your character. This is basically going to give it more context and more relevance as to what sort of answers it should respond to. It can get, basically auto-generate a system prompt, but you can just simply write in your own system prompt. There's a user prompt over here, which is going to specify the types of generation based off the queries. You have text-to-speech services, you have Google TTS, Edge TTS, or even Eleven Labs. You can even select your own voice. You can select female voices, but you can have it so that you can clone a new voice where you can record your own voice or you can upload your own voice. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to upload a snippet of my own voice so that it can try to replicate it. So once you have uploaded your voice, you can then simply just click on clone that voice and then you can head down and then click submit. It'll take 30 seconds for the new character to be available. So we can see that our character has been created. We can just simply click on chat with me and within a couple of seconds, it's going to... Hi, my friend. What brings you here today? Yep. There we go. It mimicked my voice over there and it basically said this. Now, something cool to note is that if you are to click on this drop down menu, you can choose between different large language models to have the generation be outputted through that large language model. And this is something that you can just keep on continuously creating, mimicking more voices and deploying these communicative AI voice agents. Now, if you are to click on explore, you can see that there's already ready fine tuned characters that you can work with. Now, the great thing is that if you are to locally install this, you can take this AI AI agent that we just recently created and we you can implement it into other workflows so that you can even export this widget into something else so that that communicative agent could be deployed somewhere else and that's the great thing about real char now i truly recommend that you take a look at the github repo because there's a lot more examples and it basically goes into detail as to how you can install this so if you're interested definitely take a look at the github repository which i'll leave a link to in the description below as well as the website which you can start creating your real-time communicative agents on the web. But with that thought, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you check out the Patreon page if you want to access our private subscriptions, which we give out completely for free. Make sure you follow us on Twitter. Great way for you to stay up to date with the latest AI news. And lastly, make sure you guys subscribe, turn on the notification bell, like this video, and check out our previous videos so you can stay up to date with the latest AI news. But with that thought, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Have an amazing day. Spread positivity, and I'll see you guys fairly shortly. Peace out, fellas.